Hello, my name is Jim Olson, and this is a short video on curve fitting with Desmos. I'm going to be using the Desmos graphing calculator. So let's go over to desmos.com slash calculator. This is quite an easy process. And if you don't follow what I'm showing you today, you can hit the question mark right here and hit regressions and Desmos will take you through the process. The first thing we need is a data set in a table. So hit the plus sign and add a table. And here you're going to be putting in your x, y ordered pairs. So my first ordered pair is 1, 452. My second ordered pair is 5, 547. And you put in all your data. Once you have your data typed into the x1, y1 table, you want to see it over here on the graph. So you're going to have to hit the wrench to change your window. The Y values go up to 666. So on my Y axis, maybe I'll make this 700. And you should see your data points here. And this is going to be a linear regression, but we could do a quadratic regression or exponential, whatever model you want to use. What we do is we type in Y1, Instead of the equal sign, you use the tilde. Then I want mx plus b, m times, except it's not x, it's x1, because x1 is my table here. Plus b and hit enter, and there are the coefficients. So let's say the direction said to round the coefficients to do two decimal places. The way you would write your answer on your paper would be y equals 23.46x plus 429.63. Curve fitting is quite easy using Desmos. Good luck to you using Desmos to create mathematical models about real world data so that you can make predictions. Have a great day.